it's Nessa Lily and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on this summertime makeup look. And I liked how it came out. I love the color combinations of reds and golds. I think they're perfect for the summertime. So I try to really incorporate some pops of golds in the look today. And yeah, and I really didn't do a bright red lip because I usually do that with a lot of my looks or tutorials or something like that. Or just kind of on an everyday basis I wanted to switch it up. So I just muted it down a little bit. So if you want to see how I got this look, then keep watching. So my eyes are already primed and set, so I'm going to be going in with my first transition shade. I'm going to be using this nice warm shade in my Morphe 35F palette. And excuse my nails, I need to do them again. <laughs> To make the crease a little darker, I use this reddish brown shade in that same palette and then I kind of mix that with the first shade just to make it even darker. To blend those two colors out, I'm going to be using this nice kind of camel brown shade on the top part of the crease just to blend. And for the lid, I was kind of feeling more of like reds and golds because I wanted this to be like a bright summery look. So I'm going to be using this burgundy shade. Now that the lid's done, just to deepen up the outer corner just a little bit, I'm going to take that same reddish brown shade on a little small crease brush and just kind of pack it out on this side. So the eyeshadow's done for now. I want to do a little something extra later on, so I'll just come back to that after my face is done. And since you guys already see how I do my face most of the time, I'm just going to speed through that process. So majority of my face makeup is already done and now I'm just going to go smoke up that lower lash line just a little bit and I'm going to be using that um, red brown shade that we use in the crease. And I'm going to get some of the shade that we used on the lid and also put it more towards the center. Now because I really want a big pop of color in the inner corner, I'm going to be using this bright gold shade. And I saw this and I was like, yes, these two colors look, look so good together. I don't know if you guys can see it because of the lighting, you know, the window's right there, but it's so nice and pretty. I think it was the perfect inner corner color. I might layer it just to give it more of a pop. I'm going to see what this shade looks like on top of it. So nice. I 
love it. To highlight the brow bone, I'm going to use that nice gold topper that I used on the inner corner, but just that color. I won't use the first, um, the first color that I used. I am going to be lining my eyes with this look, and for my liner, I'm going to be using my favorite Wet n Wild So my liner is done and I just want to do something just to give this look a little bit more of a pop. I'm going to take that gold shade that we used on the inner corner, the first gold shade, on a liner brush and spray it with some setting spray. Or if you have a gold liner that can work too. And I'm going to outline the liner. I actually just took both colors that I used in the under corner just because it wasn't popping like I wanted it to. So that's what the liner looks like. And I think it just gave it like a little bit of a pop. Like just not too big but you know not too subtle. I just thought it was well added to the look. And so now for my highlighter I'm going to be using just a little bit of blush gems. And then I'm also going to layer it with that nice white gold shade. I went really soft on the highlight today just because there's a lot of glowiness going around on the eyes so it's just like you know the face should be just a little more subtle. For my lip liner I'm going to be using the Essence Lip Pencil and Soft Berry and then on top I'm going to put um, the Wet n Wild Missy and Fierce Mega Last Lipstick. Alright, so I feel kind of stupid because I finished the look and I did not add mascara. So that's what I'm going to be doing and I'm going to use my favorite, the Sephora Full Action Mascara. I'm not putting on lashes, you would think that I would remember mascara. I don't know where my mind's at today. I love this mascara. Look at how long they make them. So pretty. So this is my summertime makeup look and I think the colors look really well together. Those reds and the pops of gold. I love those colors during the summertime. And Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for all the support on my last few videos and that just really, again, means a lot to me. So alright, I hope to see you guys next time. Bye.